Soldiers of the 1st Brigade Combat Team, 1st Cavalry Division, and the Lithuanian Land Forces participated in a joint platoon simulated training exercise today in Rukla, Lithuania. Convoys of Lithuanian M113 personnel carriers and U.S. Army Striker and Bradley fighting vehicles faced off against opposing forces of small arms fire, anti-tank weaponry, and improvised explosive devices. Lithuanian First Lieutenant Daudis Gudauchas, squad executive officer, had this to say about working with the American forces. I'm glad that we have an opportunity to work together, especially for infantry, because it's similar for, similar for us. Uh, all this time we share experience and learn some things from them. Uh, and they, I think, and the Americans learn from us something. First Lieutenant Lewis Griffith, Executive Officer assigned to Charlie Troop, 1st Squadron, 2nd Cavalry Regiment, explains the importance of today's training. Today's training was uh, very important for us because it was our first time training with our Lithuanian partners over here in uh, Rupla, Lithuania. Uh, it was very good for our American platoon of, uh, from, the, from the Striker Cavalry Regiment to train with the Lithuanians today. Uh, increased our interoperability at the platoon level. Uh, going through reaction to ambushes, um, squad attacks. Uh, it was very good training for us. These activities are part of the U.S. Army Europe-led Atlantic Resolve Land Force Assurance Training, taking place across Estonia, Latvia, Lithuania, and Poland to enhance multinational interoperability, strengthen relationships among allied militaries, contribute to regional stability, and demonstrate U.S. commitment to NATO. Reporting for 1st Brigade Combat Team, 1st Cavalry Division, this is Staff Sergeant Kimberly Braddock of the Michigan National Guard.